We often think that the anti-pagan persecutions by Christian emperors in the Roman Empire started quite late, but the reality is that Constantine himself laid the groundwork for the religious intolerance of Christianity towards all other religions, and not only towards all other religions, but also towards other interpretations of Christianity. It seems that early in his reign he was still quite tolerant of paganism, sometimes even portraying himself as the sun god, but it seems that later he grew more and more intolerant and started issuing the first anti-pagan laws ever in the Roman Empire. Sacrifices to the old gods would soon start to be forbidden. The old temples of the gods would in places be bereft of their statues. The treasuries of the old temple priests would be seized. Sometimes pagan cults were even forbidden entirely. While Christians were favored for state offices and the Christian church enjoyed many financial benefits. Thus we can see why Constantine's sons would continue this trend of religious intolerance towards paganism because their father Constantine had laid the groundwork for the destruction of the millennia old tradition of polytheism. It is thus with Constantine that the seed for the destruction of the old pagan Greco-Roman temples would be sown which would lead to cultural estrangement of such a degree that not many Greco-Roman temples would survive the following centuries.